In Britain, we're world famous tea drinkers, but coffee is increasingly becoming popular with around 70 million cups consumed each day. No doubt a large chunk of that is on the way to work in the morning. From roast to origin and from the way we serve our coffee, the choices are bewildering, which is why I'm off to meet a man who knows his Robusta from his Arabica. Hi David, thanks Hi, for Casey. joining me today. Now, you famously blended some beans to create the rarest, most expensive cup of coffee. Mm. How do you think our uh, coffee habits have changed over the years? They've changed a lot. We, uh, we've become a really sophisticated coffee culture. We're from a nation of instant coffee drinkers. We now typically drink espresso-based beverages as a, a part of our everyday life. But how does somebody like me go about making great coffee at home? Because there's so much choice out there. Most people would start, if, if they're new to espresso-based beverages, with a mild to medium roast coffee. And eventually, as you get more sophisticated, go for more complex, darker roasts. What I'm going to do is make you an espresso. Using the DeLonghi Icona machine, which is fabulous for this because it's got 15 bar professional pressure. One of the things, apart from having fresh coffee with espresso, is that you must use the right portion. You saw there I used about two teaspoons. Yeah. And that's about seven or eight grams, which is ideal for a single espresso. The tamper on the side just flattens the coffee now so that when I press the button on the machine, the extraction of the coffee will be equal. So let's just lock this in here. And that's very important to have the, the coffee nice and tight in You there. must tamp it so that when this works at 15 bar professional pressure, the extraction and the heart and soul of the coffee come through the cup. And an espresso should take about 20 to 30 seconds to produce. So here comes the espresso now. And you can see it's a golden brown colour. So yeah. it's not black. This is because it's got all the oils and sugars in the espresso. And this should taste delightful. So I'm just going to stop this around one fluid ounce. OK and let you try it. Thank you. Wow, that's really smooth. So Katie, I'm now going to make you a cappuccino. We make the espresso with right. this lovely crema and then the nation's favourite drink, which is cappuccino. <laughs> very, very simple. Using the steam wand on the machine. We heat this milk to about 65 degrees centigrade. And if you use the palm of your hand when you're steaming the milk, it doesn't take long, maybe 20 seconds you know when you can't hold the side of it that it's ready. Okay. So we've got lovely foamed milk there for the cappuccino. And all we have to do is on top of the espresso that we made earlier, pour this delicious foam, like wow. so. And get that lovely dome shape on the top. And it's optional, but most people like to drink their cappuccinos with dusted cocoa. Beautiful. Now I have to admit, I like a really nice milky coffee. So what can you do for me? Well, I think it's a cafe latte for you. Okay. Cafe latte is an espresso-based beverage with steamed and textured milk. This premium machine from DeLonghi, the prima donna, is a really simple to use, one-touch system, otherwise known in the industry as a bean-to-cup machine. So it'll make the whole drink to the top. All right, that's nice and handy. Now, I hear that the Italians might frown on my love of lattes uh, because they do love their espressos, don't they? They do. They, they do drink milk-based drinks, so lattes and cappuccinos in Italy would be a breakfast drink only. Oh, right, OK. And then the rest of the day, right through to dinner, is a, an espresso. Espressos all day. What kind of milk can I use for a latte? Can I use any kind? You can. You can use uh, skim milk, semi-skimmed, full fat. Even UHT products work perfectly on a system like this. OK. So, your latte is now finished. A cafe latte. Wonderful. Mmm, delicious. So there you have it. Don't be afraid of mixing your own beans, tailoring it to your own taste. Experiment, impress your friends and show them that you can make the perfect cup of coffee in the comfort of your own home.